Hey, what's up everyone? Welcome to uh, another episode of How to Beer. Um, so it's a nice rainy day today, right? So I'm going to go ahead and try another, a pumpkin beer this time. So this is the first in the series that I got, um, <clears throat> you know, with the Oktoberfest and pumpkins. So this is Lakefront Brewery from Milwaukee, Wisconsin, Pumpkin Lager. It's a lager brewed with real pumpkin and spices. Sorry, I got a plane going over whenever I start trying this video. Alright. <clears throat> Alright, let's go ahead and pour this thing in here. After we take a little sniff here. Alright, so there is a nice, um, robust pumpkin smell with, uh, you can smell some cinnamon, some nutmeg, and then something that smells a little sour. I don't know. We'll see what happens. All right, let's go ahead and get you down here. All right, here, let's pour this baby in here. Are you ready? Oh, looks like a nice copper color. Nice tan head there. A little cloudy. Let's see. I don't know if that's, it's like sour. Some kind of sour smells. Alright, here let's go ahead and try this. I'll try it from the bottle here right now. So again, this is, before we drink it, this is Lakefront Brewery from Milwaukee, Wisconsin. This is their pumpkin lager. Lager brewed with real pumpkin and spices. It's 6.3%. So, um, all right, <clears throat> that's all I really say on here. Okay, so let's go ahead and try this thing. So you get the pumpkin. It's not... There's not a lot of body to it. <clears throat> kind of get the pumpkin and it kind of kind of falls flat it just feels like a lighter like a light pumpkin beer um, <clears throat> like I said there's not a lot of body yeah I mean it's okay but you know the flavors not very strong there you know it's not very heavy there's not much body to this beer um, you know, so it's okay. I mean, you know, it's a, a 3.2 out of 5 easy. You know, it's an easy drinking beer. It's not too pumpkin-y, but there's not a lot of... There's not a lot of other flavors there. <coughs> you know, on the, on the nose you get some stuff, but when you drink it, it's a very subtle pumpkin. You know, you get some other spices in there, maybe some of the cinnamon nutmeg, but it's, it falls flat. You know, you get kind of... <coughs> kind of get the initial taste and then it's just kind of water watery with a slight slight flavor in there so you know um which is kind of surprising i was thinking as a 6.3 percent beer you know you'd have more oomph to it so to speak you know you'd have more to this beer but it's 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 okay i mean I'd say give it a try. Let me know what you think. But it's nothing special. It's pretty it's pretty weak in the pumpkin lager type, pumpkin beer type arena there. Um, but it's not bad. I mean, it's not off-putting. It's it doesn't have um, like t t flavors that are too strong. Some of those pumpkin beers they they they're too strong, or they have too many other flavors that take away from the actual beer. So, so like I said, I'll give this a 3-2. 
you know, um, this would be good for Thanksgiving, you know, or, um, nice, for a nice turkey dinner, or, you know, something like that, maybe if you got some, uh, cranberry stuff or something, you know, it'd be great, <clears throat> but again, it's, it's not, nothing special, um, you know, there's the, the beer there, you yeah, know, it looks, looks pretty good, it's not, uh, it's kind of a cloudy copper, but there's just, there's just not much to that beer. I, um, I only recommend it if you wanted something that tastes light, not necessarily in the alcohol per volume, like this one, because um, it's a little bit higher, but it doesn't taste that way at all, so I guess that's kind of you gotta watch out. That'd be kind of tricky <clears throat> if you're gonna have more than one or two. Um, but there's other beers out there that are better pumpkins. Um, so I have two other ones that we're gonna try in the series that I bought. Um, so we'll see how those go, and I'll compare them, and um, you know we'll go from there. So subscribe. Make sure you don't miss any of these episodes, and uh, stay tuned. Let me know what you think of this beer if you do if you do try it. Uh, or any other suggestions, pumpkin beers, uh, Oktoberfest that are out, you know, out around now that I can pick up. And I look forward to hearing from you. And until next time, everyone, enjoy your beer and drink up.